The third area um, that we're focused on, and, and this I think we're, we're probably at an earlier stage on, is really thinking through what's GNI's role in policy engagement. So given that we have this uh, broad coalition of organisations who are sat around the table working on these issues regularly together, um, it, it strikes us that there's a role for us as we mature as an organisation really to, uh, to engage on, on policy work. As I say, this is at an early stage, so, so far we've been involved in several dialogues with the OECD, um, we've started to engage with the Council of Europe, we've responded to several um, consultations from, uh, gov in, from governments around the world on these issues, uh, but I think this will be an area um, that will grow in terms of our, in terms of our work over time. And we're certainly seeing that there's an increasing interest from a number of governments um, in the work that we're doing and the potential to uh, work um, with them on areas of areas of uh, common common interest. And then I think that the final um, thing that I would highlight in terms of the work that GNI does is I think. From my perspective, it, it's, it's one of the most valuable, but it's the most difficult to describe, um, which is an unfortunate combination, <laughs> um, which is the, the opportunity to provide kind of shared learning in a safe space. So what, what I see in the 10 months that I've been in this role is um, relationships that are developing over time within, within the organisation which enable companies who are facing difficult issues and difficult decisions. Um, so it enables access to a broad range of people and organisations and thinking, uh, which can help in, in put into um, business decisions. So, you know, I mean, I think that's, as I say, it's a, it's a difficult thing to, to describe, but I think actually the, the, you know, the, the fact that we have a broad range of people around the table who have different experiences, different knowledge and often uh, direct contact with uh, people on the ground means that there's a, there's a real opportunity there for, for shared learning.